65 inch display, Wi-Fi connection, touchscreen integration, what is this? Happy New Year, game theorists. It's been about four and a half months since we first teased the digital table that we've been working on in the background here. And now it has a name, the arena. Gather your friends, come to the arena, and basically have any campaign, any adventure that, that you want. Today, I just wanna go ahead and highlight some of the upgrades because there are a lot of uh, differences from the teaser that we showed you four and a half months ago. We are back from uh, Gen Con and we had a couple days to rest, but I wanna just go over with you guys the most exciting product that we had there. Um, it was buzzing people, people just were stopping by nonstop to check out this particular table to where we are today. First, the biggest thing that you may notice is, well, these are outfitted with a lot of the accessories that we developed in 2022 and 2023, including the player wing shelf, the command center, and uh, the shield. I know why you're here, you're staring, you're going, tell me about the table, tell me about the screen, tell me about the display. What is going to be in the arena is a commercial quality digital display that's 65 inches, actually technically is 67 inches across, right? It's got Wi-Fi functionality, connectivity. You've got touch screen, compatibility, which was not in our first mock-up alpha. You've got tempered glass finish here because people were worried about, well, you know, I don't wanna play on my TV surface. Well, you don't have to worry about that because this is tempered glass. You can play minis on it. You can do whatever you want on it. George, what if somebody spills something on it? Well, I'm glad you asked. We've gasketed, gasketed the sides here and any, um, Small spills, light spills, don't worry about it because it's it's basically gonna, I'm not gonna go as far to say that this is waterproof because uh, in integration is, with, with electronics, it's probably never safe to say that. However, what I will say is please use all the different cup holders, use the cup holders. Now, onto the screen, right? How do you connect to this? Well, very simple. You can drive it via HDMI directly from a laptop. You can cast on it from your Android device or your Apple device, or you can drive it in browser mode, which has touchscreen capability. And I'm gonna show you that right now. You go and swipe up, you get the apps on here. It's, this is actually driven by um, Android uh, operating system. So there you have access to um, the Google Play Store, right? So you can actually configure this screen however you want. But we're just gonna go ahead and show you, right, the touchscreen functionality in browser mode here with the arena. So I'm gonna just go ahead and do this and maximize this, get rid of all our browsers there. Boom, here you go. You can go full campaign. Your players can then connect into the campaign, right? So you can have a physical, whether you wanna play with paper, pencil, old school style, or you wanna drive your information from, you know, your phone or a tablet or even your laptop, you can do that directly right into your game. And for all those that wanna connect all those gadgets, there are eight three-prong full plugs, there are four USB-As, there are two USB-Cs, and two fans, two exhaust fans on the underside of the arena here. Have all of your information at your fingertips accessible anytime. Have people remote in if they're not here. I mean, these are all the, the just scratching the surface on the different connectivity types that you can uh, set up with the arena. And by the way, there are six trays in here, or drawers in here that also double as dice trays. If you want to go ahead and use that, store your dice, store your minis, or you can take this deal out as upholstery line, nice and uh, soft here on the bottom, boom. So we're super excited for 2024, uh, and I hope you guys follow along as we continue to um, develop and get this ready for you guys.